clearly just drove into the back of their car and right. like it's clearly your fault. I mean, yeah. the first thing that you want to do is say like, "I'm, I'm so sorry, sorry. and you stuff. okay?" But I think it, you know, should be avoided until the police are able to like attribute fault. Right. Because that's their job. So I don't know. You exactly. Know, you just need to tell them everything that happened and be honest. And that is the next tip: is to cooperate fully with the police and tell them the truth yes tell them um what happened who's who where your dog is um and how many people are in the car yes so. even if your dog wasn't there i think they'd like to know that exactly and then you need to ask for a copy of the police report after they release you from the scene yeah because then you're getting into filling out an insurance claim which is a little confusing at times, but the police officer, I'm sure, has done it many a time, so they oh, can I'm help sure. you through everything. And then you need to contact your insurance company and uh, begin to file yeah. a claim right away yeah. if need be. There's a lot that goes into it, guys, mm -hmm. so be careful out there on the road. Whew. Yeah, for difficult. real. Um, after that, you really just need to work with your insurance company to see how you can best repair your car and the other person's car if, you know, that is the case, you know, if it's your fault and you have to do that um just basically be very cooperative yes. with the police officer and the insurance people and the others involved and you should be okay yeah yeah It'll yeah be great yeah. so be that's careful, how you guys. handle a fender bender you don't want to be in a fender bender because a lot goes into it but now you know just in case <laughs> country emma came out that was funny <laughs> I also didn't hit record at the beginning of the episode, but thankfully Emma saw it halfway through. Thanks, Emma. Um, I'm just gonna do a little editing here. Do do do. Documenting the scene. That is the second part of how to handle a. Alrighty, that sounds pretty good.